Cane Corsos are friendly working dogs that are willing to please if there is a treat at the end. These dogs can do many things, so they need an experienced owner who is willing to spend time training them in a positive but firm way. In this video, we'll talk about five of the most common health problems with cane corsos so that you can take care of your dog in the best way possible. But before we start our video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon. Number 1. Hip Dysplasia Hip dysplasia in dogs is a genetic disease that gets passed down from one generation to the next. This happens when a dog's hip joint isn't in the right place in the hip socket. This causes irritation, pain, and inflammation. You might see that your dog has trouble putting weight on one or both of its back legs. If this is the case, you should get your dog to the vet as soon as you can. Number 2. Bloat Bloating is a potentially fatal condition that happens when a dog's stomach gets too full of air and prevents blood from getting to its vital organs. In the worst cases, this can also cause your dog's stomach to flip and twist. If your dog has bloat, he may try to throw up, but not be able to pant or breathe heavily, pace, or have a stomach that is bigger than usual. Number 3. Entropion Entropion is a condition in which an eyelid rolls inwards because of a problem with the eyelid. This rolling can cause hair to rub up against the cornea, which can be very painful and make it hard to see. Most of the time, the condition runs in families and needs only minor surgery to fix. Number 4. Cherry Eye Cane Corso dogs can have more than one eye problem, which is a shame. The name cherry eye comes from the red swollen tissue that shows up when this condition is present. Cherry eye happens when a tear in a dog's third eyelid gets red and irritated. This can bother your dog and cause long-term eye problems, so it's important to see a vet as soon as possible if your dog has cherry eye. Number 5. Ear Infections Sadly, the cane corso's enormous ears can make him more susceptible to catching a cold or other illness. Because ear infections can be very painful for your dog, it is crucial to begin treatment for them as soon as you discover them, even though it may not always be possible to prevent them from occurring. So that's it for today. If you like the video, leave a comment and subscribe to our channel. Press the bell icon for latest updates. Thanks for watching.